Hi, everybody. So glad you're back again with me. Let's sing a song. You ready? Zacchaeus was a wee little man, a wee little man was he. He climbed up in a sycamore tree, for the Lord he went to see. And when the Savior passed that way, he looked up in the tree. He said, Zacchaeus, you come down from there, for I'm going to your house today, for I'm going to your house today. Let's sing one more. Ready? You are the words and the music. You are the song that I sing. You are the melody, you are the harmony, praise to your name I will bring. You are the Lord of Lords, you are the mighty God, you are the King of all kings. So now I give back to you the song that you gave to me, you are the song that I sing. Alright, today we are going to read The Giving Tree. Alright. Once there was a tree. And she loved the little boy. And every day the boy would come. And he would gather her leaves. and make them into crowns and play king of the forest. He would climb her trunk and swing from her branches. And eat apples. And they would play hide and go seek. And when he was tired, he would sleep in her shade. And the boy loved the tree. very much, and the tree was happy. But time went by. And the boy grew older. And the tree was often alone. Then one day, the boy came to the tree, and the tree said, Come, boy, come and climb up my trunk and swing from my branches and eat my apples and play in my shade and be happy. I am too big to climb and play, said the boy. I want to buy things and have fun. I want some money. Can you give me some money? I'm sorry, said the tree, but I have no money. I have only out leaves and apples. Take my apples, boy, and sell them in the city, and then you will have money and you will be happy. And so the boy climbed up the tree and got her apples and carried them away, and the tree was happy. But the boy stayed away for a long time, and the tree was sad. And then one day, the boy came back, and the tree shook with joy. And she said, come boy, climb my trunk and swing from my branches and be happy. I'm too busy to climb trees, said the boy. I want a house to keep me warm, he said. I want a wife and I want children, so I need a house. Can you give me a house? I have no house, said the tree. The forest is my home, but you may cut my branches and build a house, and you will be happy. And so the boy cut off her branches and carried them away to build his house. And the tree was happy. But the boy stood away for a long time. 
And when he came back, the tree was so happy, she could hardly speak. Come, boy, she whispered. Come and play. I am too old and sad to play, said the boy. But I want a boat that will take me far away from here. Can you give me a boat? Cut down my trunk and make a boat, she said, said the tree. And then you can sail away and be happy. So the boy cut out her trunk and made a boat and sailed away. And she was happy, but not really. After a long time, the boy came back again. I'm sorry, boy, said the tree, but I have nothing left to give you. I hope they're gone. I hid two weeks for apples, said the boy. My branches are gone, said the tree. You cannot swing on them. But I'm too old to swing on branches, said the boy. The tr my trunk is gone, said the tree. You cannot climb. I'm too tired to climb, said the boy. I am sorry, said the tree. I wish I could help give something, but I have nothing left. I am just an old stump. I am sorry. I don't need very much now, said the boy. Just a quiet place to sit and rest. I am very tired. Well, said the tree, straightening herself up. Well, an old stump is good for sitting and resting. Come, boy, sit down. Sit down and rest. And the boy did. And the tree was happy. The end. That's a very good story. So, do you know anyone who's given a lot for you? Maybe your, maybe your parents, maybe your grandparents, maybe your friends. Um, uh, Jesus gave a lot for you and for me, didn't he? Um, so think about this. How, how can you give to someone else? Maybe you, can't, you, have, you have branches to cut down. You, just can't, you can't have a trunk to cut down. But, but what can you give to someone? Can you give your love, your time, a compliment? I mean, say, hey, your shoes look good today. What can you give to someone else? Let's pray. Father in heaven, holy is your name. We come to you, to you today thanking you for all your blessings. Thank you for everything you've given to us. Thank you for your son who gave everything he had, his very life for us. Thank you for your, for your spirit who guides us through all these things that we're going through. But we ask you to be with us as we help us to figure out how we can give to people. How can we give back? How can we serve, uh, serve you and serve our, our church family and our friends and our families? How can we, so how can we give uh, more back to you and to our fam friends and family. Thank you so much for your, for your blessings. We love you, your son, Holy Spirit. We pray in your son, son Jesus' name. Amen. All right, till next time. Bye. <laughs>